All right, guys, update on the Tonka truck. Yeah, there it is. Now, when I showed you guys this on a previous video, it's missing the interior, windshield, tailgate, two hubcaps, and two white walls. Now, I also mentioned in, there, in that video that I have an interior and windshield. I had to go dig it out because I have, you know, I, I, I grab parts, spare parts, and all that. If I, you know, pick up a junk Tonka truck or nylon trunk at a yard sale, I'll, if it's you know really bad shape, I'll strip all the parts off of it and uh, junk the rest and keep whatever's good for other projects. I shouldn't say projects. I'm not. I don't do this for a living. It's just a fun little thing to do to pass the time. But anyway, so I'm digging through, and uh, one of the boxes. I only looked in two of the boxes. I think about three or four more boxes to look through of of spare parts let's call it like that but anyway uh future video i don't know if i'm gonna do it or not but i have a i, I forgot about this struck old trailer uh it's got an it's a white trailer it's got some kind of ice cream stuff advertisement on. i can't remember what it is it's actually in the house so i'm gonna have to look around getting me a struck cab for that because i don't want to put like an Ertl or tonka cab on it even though struck i believe was bought out by Ertl some time ago all right, here's the update. So I ordered, and mentioned in the previous video, I was ordered the white walls from Toy Decals. Uh, they had Tonka toys on them, not just Tonka like the truck had, but they, they worked all the same. Got the hubcaps installed. Luckily, they were old and uh, tarnished a little bit, so they worked fairly good with that. I mentioned that it was missing the tailgate. I didn't have a tailgate. I knew I didn't have a tailgate. But I pulled a trigger on this one on eBay, and it, I mentioned it was in either green or gray, so it's it's a green color. Um, I'm not going to repaint it or nothing, but I do have to drill holes in each side to secure the tailgate to the bed. Right now, it's pretty tight on there because the bed is not 100% straight by far. And interior and windshield. Windshield's not that bad. Uh, it's uh, pretty clear, but it does have some scratches on it and all. Uh, but fortunately, I had it. So all, all you have to do is just uh, bend the tabs on the bottom of the grill, pull, you know, pull the grill forward, and it slides out of the slots up here. You slide the interior windshield in as a unit, put the grill back on, and it's there. So that's that. So I'm going to show you something else. I already showed you this uh, this right here. Uh, the same guy I got that car line from. I, I go back. I guess I might have to go start watching this guy's booth. I may go over this weekend. But, but uh, I bought this from him, real cheap. Uh, the the nine inch Ford pickup bed with a no cap. But I also bought something else from him for five bucks. Hey, I paid him five bucks for that cab. Now, I have a video of a Tonka Super Tanker with a shell tanker body, and I, I want to really say it's got the plastic front end on it. And that's a shame. It's sitting on a shelf two rooms away, and, I, I, and I'm too sorry to go look. But anyway, my purpose is when I saw this for five bucks, I'm going to grow up, replace the cab with, uh, that's on the tanker with this cab because that, that cab has a ton of rust on the roof where a lot of the paint's gone. This one has rust on it too, but nowhere near as bad. But five bucks. I don't understand this guy. I mentioned in another video he had a Tonkin uh, Suburban Tanker or Suburban Pumper. Wants a fortune for it and it's beat all to pieces. But I bought the nine inch truck from him, dirt cheap. Bought this for five bucks. Bought the nine inch pickup, dirt cheap. Well, it's missing the cab. So my assumption is this: he uh, he only wants to sell perfect things, and he's just whatever he can get out of other stuff. He thinks is junk. It he'll just sell it for whatever. All right, there's a shot of both cabs. Uh, growing up, I had more of these this style cab. But I remember when in the seven, I think it's seven three seventy four, and I have still have it. My Tonka snorkel truck, and it still works. Uh, it had the plastic piece on the front, not the lower piece uh, like that. So, and, and you can see there is differences in the windshield. This windshield actually clips into the grill, where this one just sits behind this lip and slides in. 
All right, gang. That's it for that update. I appreciate you guys checking this out. Y'all have a great day.